We're learning more about a deadly trench collapse near Lowell. We're told the collapse killed two men who were working on a pole barn. News 8's Megan Bunchman spoke to the Grand Rapids Fire Department about the rescue effort. Fire crews, including Grand Rapids Department's technical rescue team, were called to last night's trench collapse that happened around 8.30 in the township of Lowell. According to the Kent County Sheriff's Department, it took crews nearly six hours to recover the bodies of a 59-year-old and 68-year-old men. They were found 14 feet deep in the ground. Crews say that the men were working on a pole barn. Technical rescues like this one typically take a team of at least six to safely recover bodies. Panels are one Walls are inserted periodically within the ditch to prevent another collapse. Basically, he thought it was maybe a 14 to 16 foot trench, about four foot wide, um, pretty sandy soil, it sounded like. And so we call it a spill pile, which is the dirt they dug, excavated out. And so that was on the ledge or the, the lip of the trench, um, which makes it even more dangerous. You have all that weight sitting there. It can cave in, and it sounds like that's what happened. We are still working to learn what caused last night's trench collapse and the names of the two men who were killed. In Grand Rapids, Megan Bunchman, News 8.